was I was reading the Science of Self Realization, and I, I had heard about the Bhagavad Gita, so I went down to a local bookshop, and I found a Bhagavad Gita there, the, the old ones with the yellow dust jacket on them, and and so I also started to read that. And I, you know, I had some interesting experiences with that, that Bhagavad Gita, but um, it, it stayed with if I still got it or not, but uh, it stayed with me for a long time, and you know, because I used to move around a lot. And yeah, I had a lot of you know very interesting experiences. A lot, a lot of you know, you really got the sense of, of how the book was was. It wasn't just a book; it was living. It was talking to me. It was communicating with me, and it was it was interacting with my life. If, you know, for, for for want of a better way of describing it, but I really felt that you know when I was going through particular experiences in my life, then I'd be reading something in the Bhagavad Gita or the science of self-realization, which was just appropriate to what was going on in my life. So from that, I, I, I understood that this, this book was, was living. It, was, it wasn't just a, you know, like some novel or something. It was actually living. It was alive and it was interacting with me. Hare Rama, 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 H